Hey guys, so me in here. Anyways, so you see her. This is a kind of moth. She's her Latin name is Manduca sexta, and as a small tyke, as a caterpillar, she is called a tobacco hornworm, and they're commonly used to feed reptiles. I let this this specific tobacco hornworm grow up to be a full-grown beautiful hawk moth, and as you can see, now a lot of people think moths as they eat clothing or stuff like that. While there are some very, very few amount of moths that will sometimes eat clothing, the most moths right here, maybe it's going to be hard to focus, if you see that little tube sticking into this, into this little thing of sugar water, that is called their proboscis. And anyways, what this proboscis does is it very, it sucks out all of the sugar water in plants. So it's, they drink nectar and they're very important for pollination. Unlike being a cloth eating monster like most people portray them, they are similar to butterflies. Um, and hawk moths specifically, they love to go out in, I forget what it's called, but they go out in dusk and dawn. And so as, now this, she was raised in captivity. So she has not been flying at all, but sometimes she flaps her wings a little bit, but captive re raised, um, Manduca sexta or tobacco hornworms generally don't fly when once they become an adult moth but so that's why you have to have them drink and hand feed them like I am right now and um, see these flowers flowers like this or sorry flowers outside is is where they hover and and shrink while in midair, similar to a hummingbird. If please, you could look up something else here on YouTube if you want to learn more. So this is the amazing Manduca sexta, also known as the adult tobacco hornworm. Thank you and Chameleon Man, signing out.